acts as instantly be turned into steam. It's pushing up through the lava and forming these bubbles. This formation is called Pele's hairs. In Icelandic, they're called Nodnahau. And in fact, you can probably get much closer to the lava in a situation like this, much more so than you could in a, in a real eruption. Uh, so it, it's amazing seeing the way that people react to it as well, because uh, I'm sure you, you know, people who've been out to an eruption site, when they, when they first reach there and they see it and they go, oh, you know, you get that wow effect. We have the same effect here. You get all the sights and sounds and smells, uh, but of course, because the lava that we're melting here has already erupted, any toxic gases and stuff have, have, have left during the course of the natural eruption. Really quickly, I can tell looking at that, I know it sounds obvious, but I can tell looking at that, but also like see it in real life. There's only so much you can appreciate something like this over a video or over a photo. Um, being in person is just a different yeah, experience on its own.